Ladies and gentlemen, your boy QC Javi is here in New York City getting ready to enjoy an epic battle between Charlotte FC and New York City FC here at Yankee Stadium. Yankee Stadium is a legendary place for the New York Yankees and all the championships and all their history and everything behind the baseball team. And today we get to experience a match, an MLS match here at Yankee Stadium. And I don't even know what to expect. I flew in this morning got to spend a little bit of time at LaGuardia because I had some work to do. I posted my latest vlog, which I'm gonna put right here in case you wanna watch it against Minnesota. Not the results we wanted, so hopefully the results today are gonna be way better. Today, I'm not gonna be struggling with my camera because I am able to get a press pass as media and cover the match today. So it's gonna be super epic. Babe Ruth Plata. All right, so I am currently in the press box area here at Yankee Stadium, and I must say, it feels really, really good to have a seat, to have like a little desk. I have my computer and everything set up. I don't know what for, because I'm just gonna be recording the vlog, but if I need to have access to my computer, I have it, because I brought it. Now, we're currently about an hour and 10 minutes before kickoff, so right now, I'm just getting to know the stadium a little bit, trying to see what I have access to and what I don't, so I make sure that I don't get in trouble. In a little bit, I'm gonna go down to the field and see where I'm able to get the shots from and, and be able to just experience that. But I'm gonna show you the view of the press box and how awesome the Yankee Stadium actually looks. It's, it's kind of weird how it's set out for a soccer match because it's a baseball stadium, right? But they they did it. Like there's a, there's a whole field right here. There's the New York FC logo everywhere and everything just looks really cool and I'm just really excited to be here. NYC FC, thank you so much for allowing me to experience this and allowing me to document it so that I can show everybody how awesome the experience is gonna be over here. Most of the fans are not inside the stadium right now and I had to ask permission to see if I could come out here and I can already see some flags over here and some drums. <laughs> scenery so it's super cool <laughs> they outside they're excited they're excited they're excited to play at home they're excited to hopefully get a win but you know Charlotte FC is not gonna be easy on them currently inside a dugout where I guess on one end of the field is where the press gets to be and I'm on the side where Charlotte FC is right now. Once the team stops warming up I'm gonna try to see the Charlotte FC fans because they are kicking right now and I'm sure that if I go over there right now I'm gonna get hit by a ball because I almost got hit already and I was on the other side of the net. Yeah. 
Vargas y Copetti. ¡Ea! Hoy es la noche de Copetti. Sí, ya, Ojalá ya, y sí. Y es el mejor lugar para hacerlo. ¿Cómo llegaste hasta acá hoy? Estoy aquí de ayer. Ah, ¿volaste? Sí, volé. Ajá, y, ¿Y qué volé. tal? ¿Cuándo te regresas? Hicimos un poco de turismo y ya pues yo llegué. ¡Ea! ¿Fuiste a la Estatua de la Libertad? Exactamente. ¡Ea! Ya. Me parece súper bien. Justo verte hasta acá. Me gusta verte ti también. Esperamos, vamos con una victoria a la Una victoria a la casa. ¡Eso, vamos! ¡Vamos, Chalo! downstairs so I can get some better gameplay footage and I have to say hi to the Charlotte FC traveling fans and it's crazy because Kerwin Vargas just scored a killer goal and I wasn't able to record it but I'm gonna find it I'm gonna find it and I'm gonna put it here for you so that you can enjoy it with me so the game just started and Charlotte FC is winning 1 to 0 so already looking good it's literally Minute four. Minute 41 and it's all tied up, baby. That's good though. We're gonna go into the half tied up. All right, so the first half is officially over. They extended that first half eight minutes. Um, luckily nothing happened, so the score is still 1-1. One, one. one of the best parts about being up here in the press box is that they usually have food for all the media people that work here. And initially I wasn't hungry. But now, because I've been walking back and forth between the goals, between the media access, between the photographer access, between the fans, I got, I got a little hungry. I got a glizzy, some potatoes, a tender, and it looks like some, some steak. into the game that I didn't realize I didn't realize that New York got one of their goals taken off for being offsides and then we just scored and our goal was taken off because of offsides and we are officially still tied we're not losing we're not losing yet it's tied it's currently minute 77 and I mean they're doing they're doing what they they can with this rain.
Últimos pensamientos del partido de hoy. ¿Qué pasó? Perdimos 2-1. Ah, siempre y... es cuando ya va a acabar el juego. ¿Tú ah. qué crees que sea el problema? El problema son la defensa y la ofensa. Todo el equipo. Todo, ¿Todo el equipo. Todo el equipo. Ya necesitamos que crezca Charito para que te metas ahí a jugar. Sí. Pero próximamente, próximamente Charito CLT con todo. Con todo. Vamos. Listo. Gracias Charito, te cuidas. Unfortunately, Charlotte FC took the L today here in New York City at the Yankee Stadium. New York has never beat Charlotte FC. I think we've won three or four games and we've tied two. And today is the first time that they beat Charlotte FC. So that's an accomplishment. And I'm sure in their home turf, it's something that they were craving and they really, really wanted. But that's it for me. This is your boy QC Javi here at Yankee Stadium for the Charlotte FC against New York City FC match where unfortunately Charlotte lost two to one. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure you like, you comment, and you subscribe. I just need to go see some other games. All these losing matches and all these losing vlogs are not, are not cutting it. It is what it is. Uh, I'm still Charlotte FC till, till I die. So that's it, peace.